we can go ahead and get started. Our first question is from Rock Kubatko. Zach, how do you feel like you can help this ball club and, and help this bullpen? Um, I think coming into the situation, uh, it's going to be um, very nice for me to come in and get my feet wet and, and start to uh, develop stuff that um, I've been wanting to work on and, and do all that. And I think uh, when that stuff uh, progresses and um, it gets to where I want it to be, I think uh, it'll be valuable for the pen. Um, in a lot of different ways, uh, I think um, I bring a lot to the table in the sense of um, my mobility around the pen and, and what I'm able to do uh, in stretches of going one to three innings. So I think that's valuable um, just about anywhere in the league, just to, to eat up innings and, and do all that. And um, as a team uh, and a teammate, I think uh, it's very valuable to have guys around the clubhouse who, who are um, talkative and um, like to express uh, their emotions throughout the day and stuff like that. And uh, luckily for me, um, I'm pretty, uh, pretty open and, and willing to meet new people and uh, express myself from the clubhouse. So I think both those are, are big things that guys can bring to the table. And uh, I'm excited to do that and, and help this team out. Dan Connolly. Zach, what's been the biggest difference for you in the minors versus the majors? Obviously, the number is a little bit different, but what do you see has been the biggest jump for you? Um, I mean, baseball's baseball, uh, first and foremost. Uh, the jump is, is always uh, a difficult one uh, in the sense of, um, just like anywhere else, when you go from high school to college, it's the best high school kids, um, and so on and so forth. So when you go from level to level, it's the best AAA guys, and now it's the best big leaguers all combining to play uh, in the, in the MLB. So, um, that jump of consistency and, uh, not only for me and being consistent in my performance, but consistent throughout lineups, consistent throughout the day to day. Um, there's not a lot of guys getting, uh, scheduled days off here. Everyone's putting their, uh, their best foot forward in order to compete every single day. So those jumps, uh, not just for me, but for, for everybody, um, it's a big jump and it's one that, uh, you got to slow it down. You got to breathe. And um, you got to remember that, like I said, it's, it's baseball and um, baseball is baseball. Uh, the MLB is definitely faster. It's quicker than AAA, but in the same sense, it's, it's three outs and you're just trying to compete and get the job done. Rich Dubroff. Hey, uh, Josh, you, uh, you went to the university of Louisville. Uh, did you talk to uh, Josh Rogers about, uh, you know, about, about, about the Orioles? Yeah, Josh is a really close friend, um, close to my family, so we're always in touch. Um, he was great throughout the transition, um, helping me with just getting to know faces and stuff like that and um, culture and uh, so on and so forth. But, um, yeah, uh, it's really nice to sometimes have a guy who uh, can bridge the gap for you. Unfortunately, Raj uh, is with a different organization now, but um, definitely a big help um, making a jump from the Sox to the Orioles. Melanie Newman. Hey, Zach, this is your first organizational change for you. It's something that your brother, Nick, has already gone through a couple times. Can you just tell us a little bit about the relationship for the two of you? Have you both been in several years now to professional baseball? And, and was he of any help now that you were making this change? Yeah, no, definitely. Uh, me and Nick, we talk quite a bit, um, just about every single day. A lot of it not having to do with baseball, more so life stuff. But uh, when baseball does work itself into the conversation, it's always good to uh, – kind of look at somebody, he's two years ahead of me, so he's gone through things, he's gone through similar hiccups, um, and to have ideas bounce off his head and see his perspective on things, and not just his perspective, but his old teammates, teammates that he has now, um, it's awesome. Um, and to have uh, my brother in professional baseball and to kind of be going through the same process is really cool, and I'm um, really fortunate to, to have that opportunity. All right, that is all the questions we have. Thanks so much for joining us, Zach. Awesome. Thank you, guys.